Well, hey folks, PC7 here, and welcome back to the channel, and welcome back to... <laughs> Thank you very much. Welcome back to Farm Sim 17. Got another map review for you today. This is Agrar Incel map, and this is by Mahu and Chef. And that... Chickens are having a good time over there. That's a little bit odd. <laughs> they just walked through the wall and then down an invisible ramp. Oh, well. Anyway, this is our spawn point, and as you can see, we do uh, start right in here with our chickens. Uh, right, which are free range. Seem to have the run of the farm. So let's have a look at the rest of it, shall we? And there is our very modern-looking house. All right, we've got a bit of kit going on here. Doesn't appear that these doors are movable. Nope. All righty. Mm-hmm. Okay. So, what do we got here? We've got our seed and fertilizer off to the side of the building. Oh, actually, that is water, according to this. Hmm. <laughs> We've got our silos here with an in and an out. Over here, we've got our fueling station. <laughs> Neat looking gas pump. Ah. Whoop. <laughs> a little bit long. And here we have a shop. Awesome. Oh, there we go. Oh, look at that. You are a weird dog. <laughs> look at that kitty go. Man, he's moving. Huh. All right, so over here, now I believe, is this one of these manure separator units, I think? Let's have a look here. Yeah, indeed. We can put... Uh, Manure digestator slurry in here, and it will give us uh, fertilizers and fuel. Fertilizers, both liquid and solid. Alrighty. Intr Whoa, <laughs> speedy. And we've got a compost master here. Whoops. Okay. So, as usual, organics and fuel. Nice inclusion. We've got all of our storage here. Hmm. You seem to be shy of tractor. <laughs> all right. storage here. Oh, I see. This will produce seed for us. Okay. Okay. That makes sense. And then over here, these are fertilizer tanks. Hmm. Alrighty. Hmm, interesting. I would imagine that's just going to count as a layer of fertilizer on the map. So, yeah, we've got our horses out in the field. I think the only animals we've actually got close that are walking distance here are sheep. So we'll go and have a little look-see, shall we? Here's our hay barn for disposition of the bales. And here's our sheeps. Hello there, woolly crunchies. Boy, oh boy. You guys gotta get to chewing this grass or you're gonna get lost out here. Nah. Now those, I don't believe... Oh, that could use... Uh, now, oh, did I, I did mention that this game is... Or this particular map is beta. Eh? So, any mistakes like this, 
I'm sure will get uh, fixed here in the very near future. So, but this is where we can actually buy our sheep. Now it says that although there are sheep in the field, you can see we don't actually own any. So let's uh, let's grab ourselves some money. Alrighty, and let's go about getting us some sheep's. There we are. We'll buy a quick ten sheeps. Yes, please. There we are. All right. That should swell out the population a bit. All right. They all seem to be on the ground. I don't have any flying sheep, or which is probably a good thing, because well, birds leave enough of a mess, right? <laughs> Who the heck wants sheep flying over your head? All right. So there, obviously, the uh, I'm sure that will get fixed before next release. Imagine when you're working on the map, you're kind of looking down like that. A bit hard to judge depth sometimes. So, all right, so that is the sheep. <laughs> hmm. What have we got here? Pallets and what looks like lettuce. Certainly can't drive up there. Although there are numbers to indicate that something goes on there. Okay, that's exactly the same materials here. A little bit of uh, a little bit of labeling before the full release might be in order for these. Well, I think it's probably just something to do with this orchard here. Well, we're perhaps going to put water in one tank and fertilizer in the other, and uh, that'll allow us this wonderful orchard that has hundreds of people <laughs> wandering around in it. I think that's what this is. This is a large orchard set up. Alrighty. Now, this is my truck. It is. Look at that. All right, let's let's uh, let's have a look at the big picture, shall we? That's not much of a picture at all. There we go. So here's our map. As you can see, it is a small single-player style map, shall we say? And it would appear that we own a fair number of the fields right off the bat. As you can see, 1, 2, 3, 5, 11, and 10. All right, and quite a few drop points for a map of this size, as we can see here. All right, a uh, number of them being straight competition. And then, of course, we've got all of our specialty ones, like the spinnery and that sort of thing. And then we've got a bunch of extra crops. And again, they need to reach a point where these things, like the cheese, either get labeled or there's some kind of mouse over. Mainly because I'm finding there's so many symbols for crops now. You know, I mean... And some of them are a little incongruous, you know. Like, this is probably yogurt. Um, that's likely beer. But then again, if, well... Yeah, there needs to be a little more of a differentiation between what we can... I mean, what is this? <laughs> I've never seen that symbol before. Hmm, well, Zucker, okay, sugar, so I can at least read that one. Huh, so we do have a lot of, uh, a lot of crops and production going on by the looks of it. They just don't, um, don't actually list them all. We come back here. Hmm. So, standard fruits. Yep, all just the standards. All right. And with that. Let's go have ourselves a proper look about here, shall we? I'm sure there's a road out of here. Ah, here we are. Here's two of our fields. A 
very uh, worker friendly fields but you would have to run a little bit of a headland on each side as you can see alrighty so off this way Alright. Okay, it would appear this will turn grass or silage, or grass or um, hay into silage. Just, wow, it's a huge facility for that. <laughs> Absolutely huge. Um. Okay, this is not marked as an animal facility here, at least not on the map. Um, it sure looks like some type of a... Hmm. Interesting. It looks like it's for calf rearing, actually. Let's just see if I can't get back onto the front end of this little bit. Alright, so this is just storage. Hmm. Slurry fill level. Hmm. Interesting. And as I say, that doesn't appear to actually be anything to do with real cows. And I haven't found a place to load them, so... Hmm. Alright. Again, we'll have to see as... Uh, yeah, I'm certainly not... Uh, see, I don't get any dialogue here. Oh, open animal dialogue. Interesting. Okay, so the map is just mislabeled, then, is what we've got going on here. Okay, there we go. All right, well, good thing we found that. Because, as I said, this is not where the map actually shows the cow facilities to be. Huh. Well, at least not the mini-map map. Oop, I didn't want that. Sorry. Oop. <laughs> yeah, okay, we'll add $9. Um... I was still holding the shift button, that's why. Alright, because if we look at it, we should be actually getting into those guys. Elsewhere. Okay, let's go have a look. <coughs> Excuse me. So this is going to be ah, the mixed feeder facility for our cows. Alrighty, that makes sense. Alright, let's head down the road here and see what else we can find. And as you can see, it's a fairly flat map. There is a little bit of slope to some of the fields, but not a lot. Okay, now here is our DGA. We appear to have another grain tip here. Alright, digestate. Oh, nice of them to provide a ramp. We've got our pits. Like we got sitting over here. And our uh, spud gear all ready to go. Oh, sugar beet gear, I guess, is it? Yeah. All right, good. Okay, so there's the BGA. Fits into the area very well, I think. All righty. And up here... Oh, okay, here's our spinnery. So that we can sell our wool right there. Here is our fuel station. 
And I believe this would be the garden center? It is indeed. There we are. glittery with that particular texture. Whoops. <laughs> and we have a levitating Bronco. Oh, in fact, all of these vehicles are a little off the mark. Well, not all of them, <laughs> but some of them are definitely a little floaty. There's our bank. Great. Alrighty. Oops. Need to go the other way here, I think. every animal noise imaginable out of this building. But it appears... Oh, there's pigs. Sheep. Huh. Get around to the entry old side here. Alright. So, Castor Foods. Ah, okay, so this is actually where we purchase our crit hairs then. Okay, that makes sense. And this building is simply uh, here to indicate that they have storage for millions of critters. And a... Uh, Nice little extra lot here for your placeables. Well, you get a watch, you don't have... Yeah, horses running through the... Uh... Oh. Okay, we sell here, and they are also producing meat and sausage. All right, so there is a bit of production going on there. And it said you got to watch the uh, horses going through your building, though. There's no tip labeled here. I think the map needs a little bit of uh, balancing to the rest of the system here. Some items seem to be slightly out of place. Well, that's all right. I'm sure that will. Again, this is only a uh, beta version. All right. Uh, that's not going to get me into there. So we'll not try. <laughs> Been in there, that's our spinnery. And if we follow the horse, we'll get down here. Huh. All right, we've got a tip point here. which is Hoffen Diesel, which... Oh, quite a few different products here. Hmm. Again, not all of them clearly labeled, but... something I think we could figure out. Oh, I think there's supposed to be water in there. It doesn't look like it quite took. Now 
here. Obviously, we've got more production. Oh, okay, I recognize this. Although they have added a couple of concrete ramps. Yeah, we chuck logs in here and it'll give us wood chips. And said they've added these ramps. Alright. And then we've got a sawmill here. Okay. We've got our skid steer sitting over here. Where we would have... Looks like wood chips to boards. And to pallets. Pallets and boxes? Hmm. Alright. So, there is definitely some production going on. Again, it'll be nice once everything is properly labeled up. <coughs> but other than that, very nice. Alright, let's see about heading into the uh, main part of this, shall we? There appears to be a place with quite a few different points, bakery, spar, fuel sales, Ooh, roundabout, oh uh, yeah, that's got to be the right way, <laughs> alright, uh, oh, maybe in there, go oh, I'm gonna cut across this lawn <laughs> there we are okay so is this the bakery uh, would appear to be and the bakery is going to take pretty much everything for grains. Excellent. I got another bank over there. Again, a little bit more labeling here is going to uh, really make things peak well. We've got another mixer here. Now this appears to be Again, it's not quite where it shows on the map, but I'm sure these are things that can be adjusted. Those as well, he's going to have to uh, start ensuring these actually touch the ground. Hmm. Alright, I'm not getting any uh, open for there, so... There we go. Animal dialogue. We can buy us some piggies. Okay, there we are. Again, a little disappointing. They weren't given a shade tree, but I'm sure we can straighten that out. Yeah, all of these need a little bit of adjustment. The triggers. Yeah, see, according to this, the pigs are down this way somewhere. But, as we know, that in fact is the BGA. So, I think there were probably some changes made. Either that or this was built over a different map to start with. Alright. So, here's more of these orchard trees. What have we not seen? And let's go... Well... Let's go here. Alright. So this is Hoffen. Where we can... Pretty much everything again. 
at least as far as grains go. Which is this tip point. And again, they don't seem to have uh, actually filled it with water. <laughs> But yeah, it shows another tip point I assume is down there. So there are definitely still some errors to deal with on this map. Um, but again, as I say, it is beta. And uh, all right, I think that's pretty much, other than the windmill, pretty much it. So yeah, it looks like it's going to be a really decent single-player map. But again, it is beta, and it does definitely need a little bit of help. Um, so we will check back with this at another time, if there is a progress or, to be made on, and uh, see how they make out with it. Really pretty little map, actually. Not bad at all. So that is Agrar Incel map, uh, beta. And uh, there will be a link to where you can get it if you want to keep track of it as well down below in the description because uh, yeah there are a few things that need a little bit of fixing here and there all right folks hope you enjoyed if you did remember to please hit that like button and don't forget if you haven't subscribed yet feel free to do so now and uh we'll get out and visit the flying boats so there you go take care of each other folks this has been species 7 ciao for now Ooh, look i'm walking in the air